Hey, what's up, YouTube? Happy New Year, man, to everybody out there. You know what I'm saying? This is the first video that I'm doing. Well, I got videos I ain't posted up, but this is the first reaction I'm doing in 23. You know what I'm saying? I hope everybody have a spectacular year. 23 is the year, man. Hey, let's get it. Let's go, man. I ain't going to keep y'all waiting, man. Tupac, Black Cotton. Hey, what's up, Wood fella? Black Cotton, OG. That's important to say. Because I think I did Black Cotton, but this is the OG version. Go check the playlist. Black Cotton, stay stressed as Smith and Wesson's got my blessings. Classes is session. The worst question is the first question. Why do we work like slaves, sweat and blaze to an early grave? Never got paid, but still we slave in the non trade Hold up. Not to be phony and positive, but it's net but negative. Wait a minute, hold up. Black black and live, not to be phony and positive, but won't be negative. What's the matter, G He say not to be phony and positive, but why be negative? That's interesting. Hold up. Take it. Live, not to be phony and positive, but won't be negative. What's the matter, G black cat got your thumb fat track? Got your song now, y'all. Do you feel me? Wait a minute, he say, if not peace, then let's get a piece. He tired of seeing bodies on the street. You know what I'm saying? Tupac was always on some positive type stuff, man, especially when it came to the black community. He was all about that, you know what I'm saying? And I, like I always say, and I'm going to keep saying even in 23, that's what separated him from a lot of rappers. His topics, you know what I'm saying? Real life topics, stuff we still dealing with nowadays, you know what I'm saying? It's crazy. That man been gone like almost 30 years, damn near 30 years now. And we still facing the same adversities, man. It's incredible, man, like how far in time he was. He was way ahead of his time, you know what I'm saying? Time would have to damn time travel back and then speed up to catch up with Tupac. It's just crazy, man. Like, the dude's just amazing, man. It's not peace, then at least let's get a piece. I'm tired of seeing bodies on the streets. Disease, looking through my high school yearbook. Reminiscing of the tears as the years took. One homie, two homie, three homies. Ooh, ooh. We used to have truth, but now there's no more use to shoot. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. What did he say? We tell the truth, but there's no more use to shoot. Wait a minute, hold up. We used to have truth, but now there's no more you to shoot. God come save the misbegotten. Lost kettle souls of black cock. And God You know, I'm going to pause right there doing the um, chorus or whatnot. And Tupac, I figured it out. The last reaction I did for Tupac, you can probably go back and look at it. And if it wasn't the last Tupac video, what's the one it has? It's got to be the one before that. But check the last two that I did. And I figured out what it was to me with Tupac. This is what it is, man. It's the way that he expressed himself and he talked with emphasis on everything like Everything he say, man, got everything. you can feel it. Like the power coming from him, like the vo his voice, man. Like it's just the emphasis on. It. He put them emphasis, man. You just it just force you to feel. You gonna feel it. You know what I'm saying? Like you know, like it's just something in your spirit when he put them emphasis on it. Like it's crazy, man. Like 
I'm surprised. I ain't even gonna say it, man. I ain't even gonna say it. If you smart enough to know what I was about to say, then you know. You know what I'm saying? But it's the emphasis. That's it, crazy. Oh, Out. Wait, 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 it said wasn't born with a silver spoon, never had it made. You know what I'm saying? That's real life, man. Like, oh, and that's another thing. Tupac always picked people that could relate to what's going on. You know what I'm saying? He ain't going to pick anybody. You got to relate to the stuff he talking about, the topic. You got to be able to just, yeah, that, that's dope to me, man. That's dope. <laughs> Straight piss. Mama told me that be days like this, but I'm pissed. That shit crazy. What is he saying? They claim that I'm violent. Is that what he said in the background? I can hear Tupac. You know, you have to listen to Tupac songs all the way to the end because now he don't start saying something in the background but the beat and they talking but he's saying something. You know what I'm saying? I know he said moments every day daily but he's saying something else. I think he's saying they claim that I'm violent or something like that. I can't make it out. Hold up. <laughs> Yeah, that's what he's saying. They claim that I'm violent. <laughs> interesting. Very interesting, Black Cotton, man. Like I said, Tupac, one of them ones, man. The legendary Machiavelli lives on, man. He'll never die. You know what I'm saying? Never. It'll be fucking... I, listen, man. Honestly. It'll be a hundred years from now, and motherfuckers will still be listening to Tupac. He'll still be getting more spins than your favorite rapper a hundred years from now. And that's insane to me, man. That is just insane, man. Like, I couldn't, I can't imagine if he hadn't died, man. You know what I'm saying? I know a lot of y'all gonna be like, man, Tupac ain't dead, man. You know what I'm saying? I know that, man. You know what I'm saying? But you never know. But far as the music part, can you imagine if he was still in the studio making songs? All the classic hits we would have had, hundreds. That man would have been on put out hundreds, thousands of songs in that time frame. Like, like I said, he'd been dead for like almost 30 years. Think about it, he'd been on put out the way he was moving, music and songs. He'd been literally done put out thousands of songs, man. It would have been incredible. Like something that hip hop, I mean, never seen before. He would have did that. For real, for real. Because look how much he put out within the time that he started rapping to the time he died. Think about it. Look at all the movies he did. 
Think, look what that man did. I know for sure, man, he would have been like an activist talking like by now. By now, he probably would have been done rapping, though. He probably been like a CEO of a record label or something like that. I know he would have been a major movie star, no doubt. But, uh, yeah, man, I can go on and on talking about Tupac. But I'm going to get up out of here, man. I might do another Pac joint now that I'm in the studio, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm in the box, man. Hey, Like I said before, man, Happy New Year to everybody out there. Thanks for the request, Woodfella, man. Hey, man, you know what I'm saying? Hit me on the ground, dog. Hit me on the ground, man. I be checking my inbox and stuff. Sometimes I don't be on there, you know what I'm saying? But when I see it, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to hit you back. And that's the quickest way to get your request in, too, people, man. Hit my Instagram, you know what I'm saying? The underscore reaction underscore box. That's my Instagram. But other than that, man, I'm going to holler at y'all in the next reaction. Let's get it. Let's go. Peace.